The Quickie QXI is equipped with an adjustable axle plate for the center of gravity and seat to floor height adjustments. The chair ships from the factory with the specified rear seat to floor height and the one inch center of gravity position. In essence, this means that the axle receiver is located one inch in front of the back post. If it is determined that the center of gravity needs to move forward once the chair arrives, it is a quick adjustment made with any tool that fits a 10 mm hex head bolt. To make this adjustment, begin by loosening the top and bottom axle plate bolts located on the inside of the chair frame. Once loosened, the clamp is free to move on the upper frame and the indexed clamp is free to move on the lower frame. The indexed positions are in quarter inch increments. Once the plate has been moved to a new desired position, retighten both bolts with a torque wrench and ensure that the clamp is on straight. It is important to always do the final tighten with the torque wrench to ensure proper tension. Consult the owner's manual for torque specifications. To ensure the other side is moved to an identical position, count the index holes behind the axle plate. In this case, there are four. Each side can be adjusted in under a minute. Sometimes, during the final fitting, it becomes necessary to also adjust the rear seat to floor height. Again, using the same 10 mm tool, simply loosen the top bolt and remove the bottom bolt. In a ratcheting style, move the plate up or down to desired height. Once this is achieved, hand retighten the top bolt and insert the bottom bolt. It is important to always do the final tighten with a torque wrench to ensure proper tension. Consult the owner's manual for torque specifications. Again, the number of exposed index holes creates an excellent reference for the sleeve on the opposite side of the chair. Each side can be adjusted in under a minute.